Alright, tukianza kukumbusha na jinsi ya, ku, ya kupima yale masensa na jinsi ambao masensa ya kwenye gari yafanyaje kazi na ile ma control box, right? Um, au au maybe yani unataka on, on, kujua kwa nini hichi kijamaa hichi control box kinaweka kwenye gari na kinafanyaje kazi, okay? Au kwa nini gari inakuwa na masensa mengi, manini, manini masensa mengi mengi, okay? You know Zamani okay ngoja tupate feedback ya kwa nini hizi vijama vilioka kwenye gari you know zamani gari zilikuwa zina zinaharibu mazingira hivi right so watafuta jinsi yote ya kufanya gari hizi zisiharibu ile upepo ambao unatoka kwenye nyingi usiharibu mazingira okay then walikuwa wanataka wafanye gari ziwe comfortable kusafirisha you know yani uwe comfortable kama unasafiri kwenye gari unakuwa very comfortable unakuwa kama uko nyumbani you know walitafuta jinsi yote ya kuongeza nguvu gari zifanye kwenye nguvu kama zini, kama zinakimbia sana hivi you know watafuta jinsi yote ya yeah. alafu tena waitafuta njia ya kupunguza gharama za gharama ya mafuta okay so yani waitafuta jinsi ya kuongeza nguvu kwenye gari guys we quite comfortable yani kwa mafuta matumisha mafuta machache hivi gharama za mafuta ipungue alafu na gari ziwe kama i store motion buyer so okay jinsi unaona binadamu anategemea chakula na upepo ili kuweza kuishi ku survive right kuishi you know so hata gari yenyewe inategemea mafuta upepo na zingine zinategemea ambazo sasa zinategemea sana ile spark ile so you know so you know so na maana ukichezea ile mafuta ukicheza mafuta na upepo unaweza ku tafuta jinsi ambao unaweza kupata high performance comfort na shuji low fuel consumption na vingine na vingine okay so So ili kuweza kukamilika yani kupata hizi vitu ambao walitaka kwenye gari right so walifikiria kwa sababu gari inategemea upepo na, na na mafuta right so walifikiria jinsi yote ya kuchezea upepo ambao unaingia kwenye engine yani jinsi ya kuchezea upepo ambao unaingia kwenye engine jinsi yani upepo unaingia kwenye engine jinsi ya kuchezea yale mafuta yale mafuta paka ingie pale kwenye engine kuinjectwa kwa mafuta yani wachezea waone kama wanaweza okay walijaribu na carburetor lakini carburetor ilikuwa haifanyi kazi poa you know carburetor lakini haikuwa haifanyi kazi poa so again walifikiria jinsi, jinsi nyingine ya kufanya yale mafuta yani jinsi ya kuchoma yale mafuta ili waweze kutimiza na ile vitu vya ambao wanataka ndio maana waliweka hizi ma bla bla hizi ma kama crankshaft sensor hivi hivi cop zile coil on plug you know alafu tena baada ya kuchoma yale mafuta walitafuta jinsi yote ya kupunguza ile popo mbaya ili usitoke kwenye engine yani so walitafuta jinsi hiyo walitafuta njia ya kiza ile popo mbaya kwenye engine ili popo utoke ili popo unatoka smart you know au garage toys ile moshi mbaya okay so ndio maana ndio maana tukima garage squeezer zi let anything right so 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 ili kuweza kupa ili kuweza kupata high performance na vile bla 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 jina ambao walikuwa nataka right so ndo maana waligundua kitu kinaitwa engine management system you know engine man yani jinsi ya kuona oh my god Engi, okay control system right au same management engine management system right jinsi ya kama kuna so wanajua so waligundua vile vi sensor vi actuator hivi hivi you know waligundua hivi actuator hivi okay jinsi ambayo tutaona jinsi ambayo hizi vi akina sensor ambayo vinafanya kazi right so waligundua hizi vi akina sensor hivi na vi actuator ili iweze ku ku ku, 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 ku balance hilo bit right so ndio maana waligundua control unit control box nyingine inaita control box nyingine control unit nyingine ECU but same thing right sasa hii control unit Yes, ambayo inapata inakuwa kama katikati inakuwa kama ina manage yani oh, inakuwa katikati oh my god I'm going to say about it okay this boy okay this boy control engine control box inafanya kazi right inategemea na input signals kutoka kwenye sensors na alafu inamwambia actuators zi, zifanya kazi so tujua okay mbele mbele tujua tofauti kati ya actuators na sensors anina, na nina na ambao zinafanya kazi right so 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 kwa sababu walikuwa wanataka wapate high performance na vile vile ambao jinsi ambao tumeona right so ndio maana waligundua hii control box ili iweze ku, ku, ku okay ndio maana waligundua control box 
ili uweze kumonitor na kumanage jinsi ambao upepo unaingia kwenye gari hivi jinsi ambao na kanyaga sijui nini jinsi ambao mafuta wanaingia kwenye engine jinsi ambao parking zinafanya you know so naona ona gari squeeze ziko na hizo madoido 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 main right so what are going to do i mean what are going to do tutang tutaangalia jinsi ambao hizi masensa zote jinsi ambao zinafanya kazi jinsi ambao zinapimwa jinsi oh, gari inafanyaje ikiwa kama sensa fulani iko na shida na nina nina nini you know symptoms right you know so we're going to see all all these sensors we won't get a thorough explanation of about how all these sensors work is sensors zinafanyaje kazi unazipimaje na nina 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 okay tena okay okay tutaanza na tutaanza na engine management system tutaanza na system ya engine right kwa sababu gari inakuwa na inakuwa na control nyingi hizi control nyingi gari na, iko na control nyingi nyingi zote zote tutakava system za, zate zote zote right ili tujue jinsi ambao hizi control zinafanya kazi kwa sababu na tena jinsi ambao hizi control box ambao zimetengenezwa nimetengeneza na okay nisema kwa Kiswahili sijui nisemaje okay we call it high redundancy right yani kitu cha kufa kwenye gari cha mwisho ni control box you know ni control box so kabla hoja kulupuka kusema kama control box ndio imekufa yani inakuwa vizuri ukichunguza zile sensa zingine zinafanya zinafanya kazi yani unazicheck unazipima uone kama zinafanya kazi poa au bla bla okay okay wengine wengine okay alafu okay ukitengeneza hivi tutajua Okay tangaza sijui open loop close loop na maanisha nini hivi na hivi na hivi na hivi na hivi okay so okay so don't be scared right because how close loop come okay let, okay let me just give you a small light about what close loop and open loop means right no no for example this is a air flow meter right and this is a control box control in, okay ini control box alafu ini injector right so uh, ini ini hydro whatever this is a feedback what is it this is a catalytic converter right Okay, but okay, moja nijaribu kukumbusha maana ya closed loop na open loop, right? So una kama hii ni air flow meter, naona hii ni air flow meter, mass air flow sensor. Yaani inachunguza upepo ambao unaingia kwenye gari. Ila upepo ukiwa wa ubaridi ina maana utapeleka hii sensor itapeleka umbea kwenye hii control box. Alafu control box itajua cha kumwambia injector. Kwa mfano kama upepo ni ni wa baridi, itamwambia injector bana injector ongeza mafuta hii kwa sababu injini lazima ipate moto kwa sababu upepo inje wa baridi. You know, um, I mean sorry, injector is this side, I'm sorry. <laughs> anyway, okay. Okay, you know, open loop. So ina maana control box inategemea umbea kutoka kwa huyu alafu imwambie huyu injector cha kufanya au control box inaweza kwenda tegemea umbea kutoka kwenye oxygen sensor ili okay i don't know if what i'm talking about is making sense right okay no, no, okay look at the sign right umbea unatoka huku unaingia huku kwenye control box alafu control box inaupeleka kwa ina, control box inamwambia injector cha kufanya ina maana hii hii yes air flow meter isipopeleka umbea huku ile inaitwa open inaitwa op, open loop I, kama hii sensor ipeleke umbea kwa inaitwa open loop kama kama you know, it's like a switch man it's like a switch you know kama hii sensor lazima ipeleke umbea huko alafu hii control box itajua cha kulingana na huyu umbea itapokea kutoka kwenye itamwambia huyu injector cha kufanya right so ukifika wakati kwamba hii sensor hii control box inapokea umbea kutoka kwenye umbea kutoka kwenye air flow meter ndo unaitwa open loop you know if we come maybe sensor jipokea maybe kwenye kali converter au chochote kingine right that's called an open loop right so no maana hiyo inaitwa open tutaangalia jinsi ambayo air flow inafanya kazi na jinsi ya kuipima na jinsi na jinsi gari inakuwa kama hiyo sensor iko na shida okay so next we going to see how other sensors work and everything sensor nyingine ambazo zinafanyaje kazi na jinsi ya kuzipima na na vingine okay so ciao chipedama